Meet Solar Juice. Solar Juice is the name of our project, which is an outdoor solar powered charging station. It's able to track the sun using a rotational rod with one axis tracking. It also has AC charging and DC charging. As you can see, there is a load connected to the four DC ports where these wires here are connected down to the charge controller, which is connected to the battery. The battery voltage is directly sent from the charge controller into the load connection. These boxes here work as a step down converter from the 12 volt input to a five volt output for the DC charge here. And you can see from this device that it is charging. So it is working and connected. You also have an AC connection, a laptop. The AC, we have two AC ports. The AC ports are correct connected directly to the inverter where the inverter has terminals that connect directly to the battery terminals. You can see that this one is also plugged in and it is also charging. So our system is able to power both AC and DC devices very simply. As long as there is charge on the battery, there should be able to charge multiple devices at once, as is seen here. The one axis tracking is done with a brake that is placed inside of this box that has multiple rings, and each ring has a different hole in which the stopper stops into. Then you use this rod to rotate the panel, which will be demonstrated now. This is our charge controller. It is connected to the solar panel, the battery, and the DC load. The battery is currently at 12.5 volts, and the smiley face tells you that it's happy right now. The system is working great. The current from the panel is currently at 1.1 amps because we're in the shade. The current to the battery is 0.3 amps and current to the load is 0.8 amps, since there is currently a load connected. If there was no load connected, it would just show zero. This is the total power or charge that's been used since the system has started running. It's at 12 currently. This is how much charge the load has used since the system has started running. Right now the battery is currently charged to 90% at 12.5 volts. The charge controller functions as a means to control the current coming from the solar panel through these wires and then regulate that to the battery which is here. The battery is then displayed on the screen battery voltage and from battery voltage the battery output is then extended to the load output, which goes up inside into the pole, which connects up, which connects upward to where the DC load is connected on top of the table. The battery is then also hooked up to the AC to DC converter, which has terminals connected on top, and the Inverter has two outlets already imply, inputted onto the system, which also goes up inside of the staff of the pole, 
up to where the table is.